what's going on guys welcome back to another video where today we're going to be playing FNAF uh, RP um, Fazbear's Frights Fazbear's Frights so uh, this is a FNAF 3 roleplay uh, I'm not sure if you've heard of it but this guy's made two roleplays uh, FNAF 2 uh, and uh, FNAF 1 and a FNAF 4 one, which isn't accessible. Out my way, please. Uh, so, yeah, we're going to be uh, looking at the newest badges in this game, then being, uh, well, I'm, I'm going to tell you in a minute, aren't I? So, um, yeah, let's get into it. Right, so the first badge we're going to be getting is Wasteland, which doesn't have a description for some reason. Uh, but, so, to get the Wasteland badge, we're going to want to run through it, just be ourselves. And we're going to want to go around near the back of the pizzeria, I believe. And apparently something behind here. Something behind at the back of the pizzeria. I think that it, that's it there. It's like a yes. So you're going to want to come over to here. Right behind the pizzeria. And you're going to want to touch this and you'll get the badge. Which I already have. So you don't need. Uh, well, I don't need. So, yeah, let's get straight on to the next one. Right, so the next one we're going to be getting will be the um, Ringmaster Foxy one, which is Dark Circus. And it's got a description. It says, able to get, but the morph's going to be remodeled. So, it doesn't really have a you know description of where it's going to be, but, but you know, we're going to have to find it. So, what you want to do is go through here and... I actually don't know. I think I'll have to have a look, a, a look around for this one. I believe it's somewhere here. I'm not sure. I just keep looking around. I just like looking. So, I th believe it may be down this hole. Ow. <laughs> I believe it may be here. No, no, no. Excuse me. <laughs> so, it's not here. Alright, guys. So, I'm going to get back to when I've got you know the research on where it is and when I've got uh, that research then I'll be able to show it for you guys so uh, yeah see you in a minute okay guys so I know where it is now I've done a bit of research and I've looked around for ages and I finally found it so all you're gonna want to do is if you're looking at the road so if you spawned in you go back out here and you go straight down the road, take a left if you're coming that way, or if you're looking this way, then go right. Down here into the tunnel, I believe. And I don't know if you can see that, but there's a poster. Let me try and get a clear view on it. I don't think I can. There's a poster here, which says Fazbear Circus. It's FNAF AR. But what you want to do is just go into it, oh, go into it, and you're going to get the badge. Uh, so I, I think that might be it. Uh, but the, there is one thing I'd like to show, which is a, a, a badge that's upcoming, but I will show you when it's out. Fred Trap. Uh, no description yet or anything. Uh, but if you go to the back of these trees somewhere, underneath these trees, there should be a hat, like a rotten hat or something. Let me, let me through. Let me, let me, yeah, let me through. Uh, if we look at the back here... And there should, it should be here somewhere. It basically, it's just a hat. Uh, like a Fredbear hat. I don't think it's this far uh, in. Might be further back there. So, uh, Yeah, but amongst these trees is like a... It's just a little hat. Nice little hat. And uh, it'll grant access to the Fred Trap badge when it comes out. So, yeah, that's pretty much it so let's get on to looking at the characters i guess right guys so we're going to be looking at the new morphs that we got now so uh, if we go straight over to the fnaf ar section we're going to find a dark circus right here running access to this nice little morph here um a ringmaster foxy from fnaf ar so Idle animation looks pretty cool. I'm, I'm a very, 
I'm very ex I was very excited to see this one when I was first looking. This is the one I wanted the most. It just looked the best. And if they're remodeling this, I know how much, cause how much commitment put is put into it. Like as you can see, there's skins here that you can't actually get in the game. Uh, they're from like FNAF 2, FNAF 1. Uh, the role plays and they all link together. Like if you get a badge, then you can play it on here, which is pretty cool. Uh, we've got a nice little performance here. Nice, very, very, you know, very, very sporadic movements everywhere, very robotic. And we've got to turn off number one. I don't think it's turned off right there. I don't think you should leave him like that. And then there's, we've got to turn off number two. He's st still not turned off. Can you turn it? Someone turn off this animatronic person, please. And we've got a jump scare. Ooh, it's even got the FNAF AR screen, which I appreciate. And then we've got a nice eye. It glows, isn't it? That would, if they had that head in the actual FNAF 3, that would be a lot scarier because, you know, it's a fox with sharp teeth instead of like a, where the cheek lamp is in down the hallway, in that hall, one hallway where the puppet spawns there. Uh, so yeah, that's a uh, Remaster Foxy. Let's uh, get straight on to the other badge, which is Radioactive Foxy. Right, guys. So the next badge that we got was the Wasteland badge with the uh, do 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 with Radioactive Foxy. Oh, this guy has changed. Last time I played as him, he was a lot more. He was a lot like, you know, he was a lot f like f well fatter. His limbs were a lot more. Uh, you know, you can see the endoskeleton more now is what I mean. But yeah, looking at Radioactive Fox here. He looks pretty cool on the outside. Uh, I play this one mostly in FNAF 2 roleplay. That's probably the one that he works on the most, you can really tell. Uh, I'll link all of the games in the description. But, wow. Look at this. Look, at, Just look at that performance. And the double hook as well. And he's got a jaw movement. Jaw. Let's move the jaw, please. Yeah, moving the jaw. Moving the jaw. Got a twitch. Don't get mixed with like twitches in like the platform. And then we got these turn off motions. Whoa. And then they got the eye patch. I I I eye pa I, I patch, no? Stance and a jump scare. Jeez. I I don't sound too convinced, but I am. I mean I'm I'm not happy that this can't open but uh, yeah overall this looks really good so yeah i think that's gonna be the end of it then i guess right guys so that's going to be the end of this video um like if you enjoyed subscribe if you are brand new and click a video on screen that best suits you I'll see you guys in the next video. Shout out to all these people behind me, all of these guys who worked on the game, because I may as well shout them out because, you know, I couldn't make this video won't be possible without them because they made the game. So uh, yeah, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye guys, bye. K okay, bye.